Oh. Greg. Greg. You know what we're doing today? Guys, what a, what a pleasure to travel with this, this beautiful woman. Right. <laughs> so, for Christmas, e Emily got me this cool thing. You know that thing from Stranger Things? Insert picture here. <laughs> I'm gonna be doing what's called a, a sensory deprivation tank. I think the first time I ever saw it, um, Rhett and Wink from Good Mythical Morning were doing it. And so basically, like like the Stranger Things episode, you, you go in this tank with a shit ton of salt and water to the point where you're pretty much buoyancing to where you don't notice that you're in the water and you're in pure darkness for like 30 minutes and it's like total focus. And for being someone like me, <laughs> I'm going to have such a hard time, but I think it's going to be a good time. What, what do you think, honey? I think the same. <laughs> also, um, this my wife. I, I haven't mentioned it on my YouTube channel yet, but my, my wife. So ladies, <laughs> watch out. Alright guys, we made it. Cloud Nine Wellness Center. I'll see you inside. Alright guys, um, this is the pod. It's pretty sick. So there's a thousand pounds of salt in here. And I'm gonna go into that pod for 30 minutes. It's gonna make my body feel like it's in zero gravity. So I gotta take a shower, get all the essential oils off of me. And when I go in there, I'll have to shower again after I get out, but it should be like pure zero gravity. And it looks super space age and shit. Like, look at this. And it's just so cool. So, um, I'll check back with you guys right before I go in the pod. All right guys, I uh, showered. A um, little bit of an awkward moment here, but when I adjusted the shower head, it totally fucking came off. So. I'm absolutely going to tell them about this. So Cloud9 Spa, if you're watching, I'm sorry. <laughs> um, so I'm going to get in the pod, guys, and I will see you in 30 minutes. A few minutes later. All right, guys, I finished my 30 minutes in the tub. And I'll say my initial thoughts now for more detail when I get home. But I'd say it's pretty cool. I'd say if you want to know how Eleven felt in Stranger Things, do this. You are weightless. I felt zero gravity. And it was an, a really, really interesting feeling. And you have these little earplugs so you can more immerse your head under the water. And honestly, it was... I'd say pretty dope. I'd give it for like an overall fun experience. Uh, seven out of 10. You know, it was really cool. I think it's something that somebody should always experience. I'll give you guys another look. All right, I think I'm gonna do this, what they call the hydration thing. And I'll see you in a minute. All right guys, I'm back at the house and I wanna give my honest reviews about the Cloud9 spa floating thing. So, Again, here's a picture of the pod. Um, so the pod is full of a thousand pounds of what was it, micro but carobial salt, something like that, salt. And you, because of the salt and the magnesium, you are weightless and it's supposed to be um, feeling deprivation, like zero gravity and more for pure, like pure relaxation. A lot of people use it for depression and anxiety, and they say it's good for people with autoimmune disease. Obviously, do your research. I'm not sure if it's FDA approved, but obviously do your research. 
But um, my wife was telling me that people say that massage therapists send people there and um, doctors, chiropractors, stuff like that. And they do recommend it for like meditation therapy if you're into that kind of thing. But um, like I said, I rated a 7 out of 10 for coolness. Like, you know, as someone with ADHD, I struggle with just being calm 100% of the time. And I have my moments. But um, I would say that, like, when they were talking to me, they said stuff like, you know, you're going to forget where your head is and your feet end, you know. And I, I felt that I felt my body the entire time. Obviously, I did feel weightless. I did feel it was floating. There was no physical way I was going to touch the bottom of the tank. It was that like, I was that weightless. And it did feel like nothing when I closed my eyes. But I, I knew I was still in water because I could feel the water on my body. I had to break the immersion because parts of my body were getting kind of itchy from the salt. But like I said, that might just be me. That's not a diss on the company or anything they did wrong. That's just something that I think I felt for me. Um, but it was a really cool feeling. And I honestly just put the earplugs in and relaxed for 30 minutes and closed my eyes and didn't think about anything and didn't talk. So it it was relaxa- relaxing in a sense, I'd say. But um, would I do it again? No. And uh, my wife was telling me that they recommend that you do once a week. And depending on your, your price point and your budget, I don't know if it's the most affordable thing. Hey, but if you can afford it and you like it, I, I recommend it for people that that's right up your alley. That's something you're looking for. Especially if you have anxiety, it would be a great thing to help calm you down and relax. But uh, would I do it again? Probably not. But would I say I'm excited that I was able to sit there and experience that? And it was pretty dope. Yeah, it really, really was. And if you guys like this video, um, let me know. Comment down below. If you guys like, see what you like and go ahead and subscribe. Much appreciated. But uh, other than that, um, have a good New Year, guys. If you're watching this before New Year's. Or um, Happy New Year if you're watching this after the New Year. Um, until next time, stay rabid, guys. Oh. Happy right. <laughs> hey, honest. <laughs> what? No, it's beautiful. Keep going. I wish I could zoom in. <laughs>